What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name's Amanda. Today I'm going to be doing a Target haul for you guys. It's pretty small, but it is like a first Target trip where we got to shop around since quarantine and it's still kind of quarantine in Florida, but I went anyways with a mask and nearly died. But um, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I got from Target and also I went to the next real quick and picked up um, while well, I was looking for something specific and I was able to find it. So I picked up a couple things there as well. So let's go ahead and jump right into it. Okay, so the original thing that I wanted to go there and look for is comforters for the bed. So if you guys know where to get reasonably priced comforters, I just need the comforter itself. I don't need like the under sheets or anything like that. I can't find them for like under $100 and I think that's absolutely outrageous considering I just need the comforter. So if you guys have any suggestions on where to get them, please leave them down below so I can check them out. All right, so I'm gonna start with clothes first and I got clothes so that we can make an intro for this channel and also take family pictures eventually. Um, so Mauricio has these pair of red pants that I eventually will show you guys that are like maroon colored. So I wanted to do like a maroon and black theme that kind of just is like very, I guess like calm and neutral. So for me, I just got this really, really cute black dress. Super simple, but it has little cute ties on the side. I'll insert like little videos of me trying it on. Um, and this was only 12 bucks. So if you guys are looking for like a little black dress that's very lightweight, it is ribbed, um, it is super cute, and I am obsessed with it for how much it cost. With that, I got this hat, um, extra bags, um, that I thought was super cute and would go well with it. I don't think I'm gonna take pictures with it the entire time or wear it for the entire intro, but I've been wanting like a little beach hat and this was super cute. This was, I already took the tag off of it, so. This was $10, so definitely a good price. I think like the big ones are around $20. So this one is one of my favorites that I've found so far and it's just not as floppy, so I prefer it for sure. The last thing I got clothing wise for myself is actually a new pair of shorts. I mentioned this on Instagram, but since quarantine, I have been really unmotivated to go to the gym and with Mauricio being in the Navy, we really are not supposed to be going to the gym. So gaining weight and the bloat is real from fertility medications and drinking a lot of water. Um, if you aren't aware, Clomid helps or makes you have a lot of water retention and bloating. So I got an extra pair of shorts that are a little bit bigger cause I am like a size bigger than what I normally am. So my shorts are kind of like tight where they fit, but they're just kind of uncomfortable. So I wanted another pair that are a little bit bigger and more comfortable. And I did get two baby items because I couldn't say no to them. Um, so the first one is this little cute onesie that um, was $8. And it's made from recycled material, which is really cool. Um, and it just said, current family favorite. Obviously right now, this is buying for a future baby in the future, obviously, but um, this is very gender neutral. I feel like either gender can wear it and they would look super, super cute in it. Um, so yeah, I picked this one up. And then also, this is a girl's outfit. So if we have a girl, um, this has like little strawberries on it and it was also on sale for $5. So I just couldn't pass it up because it was so cute. And it just reminded me of something I would wear when I was a little girl. So. I thought that this would just be super cute on our daughter one day. Okay, so that was the last clothing item. Now I'm gonna move on to like cosmetic stuff, which I didn't get much. Um, I got the Batiste Instant Hair Fresh Dry Shampoo, which I'm pretty sure you guys have heard of this before. I got the Fruity and Carefree Pineapple or Pink Pineapple. Um, I've actually never smelled this one. It smells very good, like very sweet. So if you guys like sweet, smelling stuff this is definitely for you and i do and anything with pineapple on it i'm sold um and then also i got this sun bum face spf i'm actually going to return this because i didn't realize this was 20 dollars for face um for sunscreen i can't even get like face sunscreen 
um, and I know that it's like eco-friendly and it has like non-toxic in it and stuff but 20 bucks is just a lot of money and there are a lot of other options out there that are not as much as this so I am gonna return this and get another option because I did put on sunscreen the other day on my face like the spray kind where you put in your hand and wipe it on and my skin was super irritated for a couple days after that so I definitely wanted to get something more face oriented um, so I made you research and find out the best alternative to this one but I've heard really great things about this one so if you guys are willing to spend $30 or $20 on it definitely look into it and then I got some Lysol wipes just because they are very hard to find right now we actually don't have any Mauricio likes to clean with these um, they're really easy to clean like doorknobs and sink faucets with as well um, so we picked up some of these And I have been in like a redecorating kind of mood. Um, that's why I want to buy a new comforter, but I really want a new comforter because this one's just super old. I've had this comforter for a while and it has a hole in it. So I want to get a new one. Um, but I got us this new um, shower curtain that's made out of 100% cotton. I am wanting, I have a cotton one now, I think. I don't know if it's cotton or what it is but I don't want to buy plastic ones so this is a super good alternative for that because we're trying to be a little bit more eco-friendly um, this one is from Magnolia from Joanna Gaines and this one is just super cute I will show you guys like a clip of it once I put it up so you guys can see this one it's very like neutral colored it has like a pink tone in it but it's more of like an off red um, very subtle pink it's not super extravagant and that is basically all I got from Target and oh I forgot I got two new shower towels bath towels because the ones we have are the are the ones that I had whenever I was living by myself are super old um, so I threw away like three or four of our old towels and replaced them with these um, I have lots of gray towels and that's what I'm trying to stick with I really like grays and whites and browns and pinks so um, that's that and then for the dogs for like our photo shoot for family photos and for our intro I got these super cute dog collars I'll show you guys a video of them hopefully together with them on they're gonna go super cute with our outfits I feel like the red there is that maroon red in there with some yellow and they'll just have the pop of color because um, really they are a pop of color in our life so um, I got a small one and a large one obviously for both dogs Harley and Dixie and then while I was there, which is what I went there for, I went there for collars, um, I found this baking dish, which was on sale for like 12 bucks, I think. And we actually got one from our wedding on my bridal shower. And I dropped it and broke it the same night. So when I saw this, it literally looks exactly like the ones that I wanted and put on our registry. I had to pick it up and I was super careful with it not to drop it because I feel like I'm known to break it so it was originally 15 and it was like on sale for 13 so it wasn't like it was a huge discount but it was on sale and I just picked it up because it's super cute and we have been making a lot of casseroles lately so I got that and that's the last thing the last thing that Mauricio bought was a fan for our room because it gets very hot we have like direct sunlight in our house um, majority of the day so we're trying to knock back on our electric bill by having a fan running we have curtains up um, but anyways that is the end of our Target haul I hope you guys enjoyed I will link as many things that I can down below so you guys can find them yourself or order them if you like um, but I will see you guys in my next one bye guys